are you worried that if you start promoting your business on Facebook, you are going to get banned? Well, this is exactly the video for you. And let's go into Facebook terms and conditions and find out. So now we are in Facebook's terms and conditions. I explicitly remember in the terms and conditions, Facebook had a sentence that said that your personal profile is not to be used for commercial gain. But surprisingly, when I searched Facebook for the word commercial, and I'm going to just show you now, you might not see the actual search, but you will see highlighted words. So there's only five places where uh, the word commercial is used here, and none of them is actually actually referring to the content that we can use on our personal profiles, which is kind of weird, right? There is no direct thing that it says, don't use your personal profile for business. So we're going to see like this part here, it's talking about the products like business pages and groups and ads. So this is not talking about our personal profile and twice they're using a uh, commercial. And then they have another three places where this word commercial is used. And so it's commercial terms and they apply if you access these products that I just mentioned for any commercial or business purpose, including advertising, operating an app on our platform, using our measuring services. So the insights, managing a group or a page for a business or selling goods or services. Yes, we are selling goods or services, but you have to really think about it. This is the platform, right? So if I am selling a coaching program, I am not using Facebook to create to actually sell that program. Uh, I am using it to promote it. I'm using it to talk about it. I'm using it to connect to potential people who are interested in this program, but I'm not using Facebook to sell for a transaction for a commercial use. Also, on my personal profile, I am not using any of the Facebook tools like insights, targeting systems, access to other users that they're selling within their advertising platform. I'm not using any of that to sell my goods. All I'm doing is talking about my business. It's so fascinating to me that in 2020, this is now October 2020, and we don't actually have anywhere in terms and conditions, anything mentioned about the commercial gain uh, and using your profile um, for commercial gain as a business. But we have to be honest and fair. We're going to go into this section here, right? Your commitment to Facebook and our community. And this is a section here uh, on who can use Facebook. Here is where you need that mindset shift and a full understanding what is actually said that you cannot do and not read into something that's not there. One of the most important things is you can only have one account. It would have been so, so good if Facebook said, you know what, you can have two accounts if you're using one for one type of people and the other for the other type of people, but that would have been in the ideal world. The other thing that we want to have a look at, so we need to, they always say, use the same name you use in everyday life, provide accurate information about yourself. So don't deceive people, which is very important because there are people who are creating Facebook profiles and they're pretending to be someone else. This can happen and, and, and it's fair enough that Facebook wants to make sure that this doesn't happen. So the next thing that we want to look at is this. Use your timeline for personal purposes, which means that which, which, which can mean whatever it can mean, but personal purpose for me personally, connecting to people that might become clients in my business and I'll sell them somewhere else. I use Thrivecard to sell my coaching programs, right? That's the checkout. I don't use Facebook to sell uh, or I don't use Facebook to advertise as such or use any of its intelligence to connect to people. I connect to people manually myself. And sometimes I talk about uh, my business and sometimes I talk about the city I live in and sometimes I talk about the doggy that I used to have and I miss and sometimes I talk about my robot cleaner. So I am using it for personal purposes and in fact in my personal life I speak about my business probably 95% of the time. I am showing up completely authentically and genuinely as Juliet Stapleton on this profile and talking about what I would have talked in the normal life and therefore there is no rule that you cannot promote your marketing and use Facebook for business. There is nothing about it in community standards. There is nothing about it in any other places. And this is a full uh, plain text terms and conditions, you know, not like separate pages or anything. They're all here. And we searched for it. And this is the only place 
where the Facebook says clearly, use your timeline for personal purposes. Well, my personal purpose is to connect to as many really well aligned people as I can who are looking for what I can teach them. And in fact, a lot of my uh, clients and leads, people who never became my clients, but, but you know, they were around, turned to be my good friends and probably better quality friends that I've ever had offline. And that's my point. And this is why I love using Facebook to support my uh, business, to promote my business. And I use a page and I use the, you know, I use all the other features. But I love using my personal profile because that's where the eyes are and that's where I can be myself. That's the virtual representation of me just as I am in my real life. Authentically, genuinely, and as passionate about my business as I really am. So I hope that this video helps you to change perspective and see that there is actually nothing in the terms and conditions that's saying that you cannot talk about your business on your personal profile. Take advantage of that, put your business hat on, think about how we get the most reach, we get to connect to people, we can choose who we're connecting to, how awesome, and take advantage of this wonderful platform so your dreams can come true just like this wonderful platform of Facebook made my dreams come true when I started using my personal profile for business. And if this is the first time that you're seeing me, my name is Juliet Stapleton. I'm a visibility strategist. I teach organic marketing using Facebook. And if you loved this video, please subscribe below. And if you're watching this on Facebook, get notifications when I'm going live or follow my page. But the best thing is come to my personal profile, follow it. You don't even have to send me a friend request. Follow it and see my work in action. And I hope I will inspire you.